Yes, sir. It's the next day. It sure is the next day after the Valentine's Day solo date adventure. Now it's my grandma's birthday. Being ten. Why would you show me something like? Oh wait, it didn't. It didn't show. These are the flowers. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we kind of got ready like ridiculously early. I fully assumed that we would just lollygag until no end, like almost being late type beat. Maybe I was gonna put in more effort. I mean, this is a good amount of effort already. So, not, not points for trying, mate. But also, I don't, I don't know what to do beyond this point. Like, if I, it falls on me to get there at a decent time. And really, we could spend some time there. We really we just pull up early. Get on some like, yeah, we just, we're already here. Who's already gonna hang out? We're just chilling. Because if not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit down and get comfortable and accidentally relax too hard. Forget I have somewhere to be. And then inevitably end up being late. How? I, 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 how you was ready early and still be late? Mm. I'ma leave it to a <laughs> to do it anyway. Leave it to a <laughs> to make it have to say. I, I, I do believe that black people uh, get places on time. <laughs> you said that with such a lack of confidence that I literally don't believe you. Bro, you know, using a fake and. I mean, like, I do, but only to a certain extent. A certain extent, A certain extent, I need a reason. He said that so long ago, and I'm just not responding. Well, it's simply because he like to be up my But what did I say? I was gonna say you're really annotating my Cornell notes right now. <laughs> I'm gonna need you to. I'm gonna need you to relax. The contrast. Notes. My Cornell notes. Do you know what Cornell notes are? I feel like I was I was psyoped into doing that. Really thinking that was like a proper way of like note taking. And the thing is, I like never took notes. I mean, I did take notes just to feel like I was doing something instead of staring at the wall. But like, I would take the notes, and never look back at them. Man, I, I, I would just write down, bro. It was like, what did you carry in your backpack? Another backpack. Mm. Inside that backpack was. Another backpack. That's the type of stuff that made me wish, instead of like all that school stuff that wasn't even gonna measure up, I wish I had been on that wave of like those kids who were selling snacks. Nah, that would have been, that would have been some bro. I mean, bro. And uh, those kids got in trouble too. I don't know what happened or how that ended up happening. Maybe they like got caught lacking with the money thing. Somebody else saw that they were making profit and wanted the money. They started getting bullied or something. And they were like, oh yeah, we can't have this. Why? Because when you do inevitably make the money and you end up becoming the snack plug. My is gonna be like, are you selling? It depends on what are you asking. You, you want your honey bun today? You know, that's a dollar. But you know, I like you today. 75 cents. See how you do this. You put some call it sell to the teacher so they don't <laughs> snitch on you. I know your big back. Hungry. I'm no, really trying. <laughs> no, I'm tweaking. No, I'm really trying to figure out like what was the problem with that? Why couldn't? Why weren't we allowed to do that? Mm. Yo, your focus is more on selling the snacks in school rather than is education. But like, if you're gonna force them to be there anyway, and they're choosing to hustle in life and grind early, because you you never know the people who think that way to even grind early that early in life to start worrying about like. Uh, let me get a little bit of pack of chain. Let me let me get in and start right quick. Let me, let me let me hustle right now. Even, like in the circus circumstance, like they are the type of people who would get a job if they weren't literally forced to be at school. They would already be making money. And depending on you know what what resources they had, that might just be drugs. I mean, bro. What if they just don't want them to uh, learn how to sell drugs? Bro? Mm. Hmm. Learning the skills by starting with snacks and then upgrade to actual drugs. <laughs> actually working, man. So, I'm saying, uh, bro, you be like, oh, this time I sit in school, do you know how many people I, you know how much money I made today? You know how much money I made this week? I stopped bringing all those books, man, and all these double bags. I'm looking like I'm uh, going to the gym. Uh, I look like I'm um, going to basketball practice. I be telling people I'm basketball. Nah, I haven't been on the team in 
I don't know how long. I dropped out a while back, and I just bring the duffel full of snacks. That's crazy, bro. And it's like, bro. And I think, like, the kids started getting, like, suspended. Like, literally being suspended on some, like, you, you need to stop selling. We can't, we can't have you do that. Why? This is going to make me ask Google or YouTube. Let me watch a video on somebody talking about this. Why can't kids sell crack in school? <laughs> All right, we just got to your city, and I got something really important to share with you. Come on. I've been thinking about a very interesting question lately. Why don't schools let people sell candy? And after thinking about it very long and hard, it comes to this one thing. They don't make profit. Schools are like businesses. They need money to operate. If they have students making money, and they're not receiving a share of that, they do not allow it. Oh, me! They are so quick to charge kids to do, uh, honestly, anything. Field trips, food, everything. But when it comes to you being the one making the money? Uh, they keep feeling some type of way. Headed to grandmother's house now? What? You ready to go? Yeah, I'm out here. Just turning the bridge. Hopping to come. Tuesdays and Thursdays. Is this what we're doing? Mm-hmm. We transition to a different car. Moving location. It's in motion. Yeah, they it's in come. motion. But I gotta change the birds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I gave them food yeah. and water. Oh, yeah. I said it to last mm -hmm. But not that. That's the best way to go. Uh, We have my it here. Pepper spray? Mommy, you didn't start laughing, did you? Because you, 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 yep. you, you, you peeped all how that happened. I, I went down. If all my dogs are my niggas behind the fence, 